No, babe, it's one can of wet food and two scoops of dry food. That's what the boys are doing. Oh, we're rolling. We're on the air, babe. I gotta go. I gotta do the news. Just give them something. They're dogs. Sorry about why, that. Why would you answer a phone call during your job? I love my, my, my pet chihuahuas. I can't believe you. I'm I sorry. Really I'm sorry. I can't, I can't We're on the air. Come on. Okay. Welcome to Paro News. Welcome. My name is Jesse Oatmeal. And I'm Shad Pancake. And today we are introducing the current events that are happening here in California. The current events today, uh, Ms. Oatmeal? Today, a cat got hit by a van. <laughs> what do you think about that? Do you think the cat just... I, I just get really upset when animals get hurt. <laughs> you know, Oatmeal, I, I just really... I'm sorry. Okay. I'm sorry. I'm sorry I brought that up. Are you fine? No, I just... They're so cute. <laughs> they don't deserve to get hit by cars. It was Let's talk about something else. It was a van. Let's talk about something else. I'm sorry. Don't cry, Bato. It's just a cat. In other news, there is some really seriously large fires going on in Southern California right now. A lot of trees are burning up. A lot of them. A lot of trees. You guys need to stop smoking. Stop and smoking. Throwing those cigarettes. Those goddamn cigarette butts are burning up this entire state. They are. They actually are. You guys need to stop smoking. It's really bad. It's really bad for you guys. In other news, a three-year-old toddler has potentially found a cure for cancer. They say that he is a prodigy of Einstein to the 10th degree, and in his three years on this earth, two and a half have been spent researching, I guess How his is that even possible? brain developed at a very quick pace. Um, so wow. that's very exciting. That's really we'll have to definitely continue to follow that story. About the kid? Yeah. I wonder how he found a cure. Yeah, I think it started with Plato, you know. With he was he was playing with Plato. Did he just do like something with the Plato or Yeah, yeah, I think he just did something with the Plato, you know? Um and and through through his experimentation there, it led to some real uh, important uh, discoveries about cancer cells, which is very exciting. That's pretty incre incredible. Yeah, my grandmother died from breast cancer, so. I'm so sorry about that. Thanks. I never got to meet her. Oh. Yeah. Sorry. Still sucks. Yeah. Glad you think it's so funny, oatmeal. <sighs> that pancake. I cannot believe all these things are going through. Anyways, why don't we move on? Let's talk about the uh, the national news now. I'm branch out of California. We got some national headlines here. Uh, oatmeal's going to take us to them. Yeah. Today we have the Olympics, but I heard something about the twerking Olympics. Have you heard about that? The twerking or twerking? Twerking. You know when the girl shakes the booty? Oh, I love that. Yeah. I love you that. You like That's that, huh? Oh, I love it. Yeah. I love it. Some women are that. especially good at that. That yeah. shaking the booty. I, Do I, you twerk much? You know, I have no idea. I need to try that. You gotta try it? Yeah, I gotta try it. Well, if you ever Do you know need... how to twerk? I twerk a little bit. I used to in college. I was a big twerker in college, but uh, not quite as much anymore. Can you anymore. show us how to twerk? Can I show? Yeah. No, I think that no, you should that, show. That would be really interesting. I think like, that you should show us because it'd be more appropriate, uh, you know, for You know, we need a perspective. You know, I can give you my perspective. Go, go for it. You should just twerk. No, I'm not going to do On that. the table. I'm not going to twerk you. I don't twerk at work. Where do you twerk? Mm, it depends. In the club, in my house, you know, in the bedroom. That's really interesting. Mm -hmm. Will you ever do the twerk Olympics? You know, I, I consider it. Like I said, I was a twerker in college. It's been a long time, you know. Um, so, you know, we all grow older and twerk less. So. I didn't know. I didn't know you had that in you. The twerking. Mm -hmm. The twerking's working. So now we're going to introduce the weather with Hector Ramos. Mm. Yeah, Mr. Ramos. Take it, Ramos. Senor Ramos, to you. You, Chad. Chad and Jesse. Your names are amazing, you know. I always think of food when I think of you. Pancake and oatmeal. Oh, I love it, waking up in the morning with that. Okay, so now we go with the weather. It's gonna rain over here, you know. It's gonna be very wet. You know, if you're gonna go outside, make sure you take an umbrella. Cause te vas a mojar pinche wey. You know, it's gonna be all over the place. Over here, it's gonna be snowing. 
I don't know about the snow personally. I grew up in Mexico. You know, we have no snow, ever. It doesn't exist. So now you come down to sunny California where we reside. It's perfect weather. I tell you, I go outside and me quito la camisa and it's hot enough that I'm, oh my God, it's amazing. You know, cooking some barbecue with my family. And you're gonna experience some thunderstorms on this side, you know. You don't wanna go outside with any metal objects, my friends. I've done it before. You know, it's, it's not good. My head is went crazy, you know. Un momento, my friends. Chingadera no sirve. Oh, hola. Sí. Unos burritos, sí. Agarame dos. Give me two. You know, I, I, I like to get full, you know. Yeah. No jodas. Mucho chingas, estoy trabajando. Déjame paz. Bye. Oh, sorry, it's my wife. She's always asking me what to eat because I get home and I tell her, you, you cooked the wrong thing. I ate that yesterday. I don't want it no more. So now we're going to get back and, you know, we're going to finish this up. Sorry for the interruption. There's something I have to tell you. All these things happening in the weather, it's, it's crazy. You know. I just wish it would be normal. One day it's hot, one day it's cold. I don't know what it's gonna be. Honestly, this could change tomorrow. But you never know. So stay tuned to Pirate News. Well, Hector, that was you really know, interesting. You know, I don't really think it's uh, God damn it, can you get off the phone already? Don't yell at me. You need to get off that Sorry, phone. Sorry, I don't know. I'm a, don't yell at me. <laughs> Look, just tell them, tell them to have the dry cleaning ready by tomorrow. It's fine, all right? If they don't have it today, just have them bring ready tomorrow, okay? All right, look, I'm on the air again. I okay, gotta go. okay. I gotta go. Bye-bye. I gotta go. Oatmeal yes. is getting all soggy on me. Oh, you know, I've told you, when I'm on the phone, you know... Like, we're on air right We'll now. talk about Are it later. Are we gonna have this way right now? Welcome back to Pyro TV, where we tell you the straightest news there is. Yes. My name is Chad Pancake. And my name is Jesse Oatmeal. You know, I can read this <laughs> in here. Like... I don't understand. It's because it's upside down, sweetheart. Oh. <laughs> there you go. Did you take a piece of my paper? I was a little hungry. You know, they don't give us very much to eat around here. <laughs> so, I think about it that paper. That's pretty interesting. Yeah. Why don't you eat paper, though? I mean, you that's, know, that's, that's fiber. Really that's fiber in it. Not so bad. Yeah. So, um, in, uh, some of the current events uh, that I think we wanted to share with uh, you guys today sick batteries. A lot of batteries are dying nowadays. Uh, there seems to be a bacteria or a, some sort of a virus going around that's infecting batteries of all types, cameras, computers, and TVs, and actually causing them to die prematurely. That's really crazy. I don't know. Batteries. Can they just charge the batteries? Why nope. would they let them die? Batteries can get sick, actually. That's a little known fact. That's crazy. I did not know that. That's really new to me. Mm -hmm. Let's go ahead and just set it off with the sports. In football. They kick it, in baseball, they swing it, in basketball, they bounce it the nuts, and that's the sports for today on the news. Mm -hmm. Can you just like get off the phone? That's excellent. I'm really looking forward to it. Get off the phone. I'm looking forward to it. Excuse me, just a second, please. We're back. Just a second, We're please. back. Just a second. We're back. Yeah, I'm going to see you. Uh-huh, 3 p.m. Perfect. I appreciate the opportunity so much. Thank you, I sir. I cannot be believe there. you. Oatmeal. Once, that was a job once again, interview. Once again, you're on the phone while we're on it. Okay. Are you even paying attention? That was a job interview. Okay. Is, you have a job. I fucking hate God this job. Damn it, man. Hey, it's we're never, back. You're a professional. All right, and we're rolling. So, Chad Pancake here. We're coming back to you with Pyro TV. And Jesse Oatmeal. Jesse Oatmeal. Well, that was a really interesting sports report with Juliana. Is that, I think you I fucked it, was it up. Who, I think you fucked up the name. <laughs> um, uh, Juliana with the news, uh, with the sports, I believe. Yeah. That was great, right? Yeah, that's not his name. That's what, his what's his name? name? Julian. Julian? Julian. <laughs> not as Juliana. Sorry. Julian. <laughs> Sorry, Julian. I think that we're supposed to go out to Harold next. Oh, yeah. Uh, Harold's out uh, doing some street interviews, trying to get uh, the public's opinion on hot topics. Yeah. Hopefully they know some of the questions that Harold has. Out to you, Harold. What's up, you guys? How you guys doing out there? This is Harold with It's Hot Out Here on the Streets. And, uh, oh, it's my microphone. I'm talking on my phone. Excuse me. I had a text message from the botch. Yeah, so we out here, and um, we're going to talk about our trending topic today. Um, so let's, let's see if we can rid of somebody on the street. Uh, excuse me, ma'am. Ma'am. Hey. Okay. Excuse me. 
Tú tienes un pelo grande. Uh, yeah, uh, yeah. How do you feel about Pokemon Go? ¿Qué es eso? The, the Go with the Pokemon. Oh, el pájaro grande. Yeah, yeah, the Mujos. ¿La tortuga? Yeah, much Pokemon. How do you feel about it? Pokemon? Yeah, that one. Tú pareces Pokemon. Yeah, yeah, I mean Pokemon and Goes. Tu pelo grande. Yeah, yeah, thank you. Sí, sí, yeah, sí, yeah. bye. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. yeah. Uh, yeah, so since I can't get a translator here, I don't know what she was saying, but we still on the street. Hey, excuse me, man. The, 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 um, how, yeah. Um, what can I get for you? Um, how do you feel about Pokemon Go? Oh, we can go. Huh? With Pokemon. With what? Huh? We can go in Pokemon. The. Okay, I'm a little confused. Do you like the game? Pokemon oh, Go. I love games. Uh, I love to play games. Yeah. Okay. Um. Mm -hmm. Uh, yeah. can, we, can, we, can we get somebody else in here, please? All right, thank you, thank you. Yeah. All right, well, I don't know what that was, but let's do one more for Pokemon Go. Let's see if we can find somebody else out here. If we got somebody. Excuse me, sir. Sir. What, what, what's up, man? What you, what you doing there on, the, on, the, on that phone? Oh, I'm actually catching a Pokemon, bro. Have you, you heard about it? You look like you got a little uh, autistic problem or something. You okay over there? Yeah, I'm all right, man. You? Just, you know, I, I have to go. You got to go where? You got to go to the bathroom? <laughs> no, man. I, you know, have you, you ever heard about this? What? Pokemon Go. Oh, that's what I'm actually talking to people about today. We're talking about Pokemon Go. There you go. go. Then you know so, about it. How do you feel about Pokemon Go? Oh, I love it, man. You love it? It's amazing. I get up every day at 4 o'clock in the morning, and that's uh, the first thing I do. The first thing you do? You yeah. You want to go first? Oh, no. I don't need to. Uh, they see, while I'm on the go, it just goes. <laughs> okay. Well... Uh, all right, well, you know, happy happy catching. I yeah, man. I, I heard there's a Dragonite over there. I'm gone. Okay. Well, th there you have it. Pokemon Go. I, I guess you got to go. Turn it over. And we are back. Yeah, look, you know, the rates are just too high on the interest. I need a, I need a financing that is a little bit more competitive. With do you not rates. understand so that you cannot be on second. the phone while we are on air? Yeah, so look, I'll give you a call later. I got to go. I'm at work. I'm at work. All right, this I is work. unbelievable. Oh, Mill, I'm trying to get some financing here, look, and they charge me an arm and a leg. No, can you give me a break? Can you give me a break, please? We're on air. Hey, and welcome back to Pyro TV. My name is Chad Pancake. And I'm Jesse Oatmeal. Thanks for tuning in again, guys. You got a little spot right here, mm -hmm. Mr. Pancake. Mm -hmm. I just wanted to make sure you look good, you know? Mm -hmm. I'm sorry about that. I'm a big fan of yours. Mm -hmm. Thank you. you. Know. Thank you. We're, we're filming. Okay. okay. Yeah, thanks. I'm good. I'm good. Thanks. Do you always get this stuff here? I mean, you talk on the phone while we're on air, and then you get your makeup done on air. Oh, no. what's, what's up with that? It's not easy I, to look good. You're being a total pancake right now. Look, I don't, I don't understand. We have completely different point of views here. That's because you're a woman. And yeah. you're a pancake. I may be a pancake, but at least I'm not a woman. You get soggy sometimes, so. Mm. Anyways, let's go and uh, see what traffic is like today in Los Angeles. We're going to take it out to my twin brother, actually, one of my least oh. favorite people in the world, so <laughs> who that's, I'm most that similar to. So that explains why one is nicer than the other one, right? Right. And to traffic with Terry. Take it away, Terry. All right, thanks for coming to Traffic Time with Terry. Uh, as you can see, traffic is totally fucked as it usually is in Los Angeles. And the 405, as you see right here, from the 101 all the way down to the coast is a parking lot, as usual. And that really makes me angry. As a matter of fact, I'm actually waiting for someone to come and meet me here at the studio, which means they're probably going to be pushed back another hour past the time they were supposed to arrive, just like everything else in LA, late an hour all the fucking time. If you look over here, you see the 10 freeway going also from the beach all the way inland towards Pomona, and even past Pomona, it is also totally fucked. Can I get a coffee, please? And it's hard to get a coffee around here. Nothing seems to run on time in this sound. Thank, thank you. I'm filming. Late. Get the fuck off the set. This is iced coffee. I said hot coffee. Thank you. Please Sorry, come Mr. back. Pancake. Okay, I'm not pancake dick. That's my brother. Aren't you so, guys brother? anyways, that's my brother. Thank you. Back to the traffic. I do apologize for that. If you look, you'll see side streets are moving just a little bit better than the freeways, but also totally fucked. If you'd like to get anywhere in this town, you might like to invest in a helicopter. If you can afford one, chances are you can't because the minimum wage here sucks. Employment sucks. People are overworked, underpaid, myself included. Now, traffic is all right if you go about three hours east out into the desert where there's no stores, no people, no houses, and nothing to do except maybe fuck a cactus. There you might be able to drive your car if you own one, if you can afford the insurance payments. 
Thank you very much. Back to you, pancake and oatmeal. That was Traffic Time with Terry. Well, thank you, Tyler. Yeah, you know, that was really that, um, stressful. Uh, a cake that feeds you know, ten I, people I is plenty. I can't do this with you being on the phone the whole time. We don't need time. a larger cake. I, I can't. You know, I just can't. I'll have to can call you, you back get later. off the phone? You know what? You know what? I'm no, ordering I'm a fed cake. Up with this. I'm, I'm ordering a cake for my friend's birthday. I don't give a damn if you're ordering a cake. You know? Do you like your job? You're the new girl here on this station on Pyro TV News. Do you like your job? I'm done with this. Get out of here! You're fired! Get away! You're fired! Get away! You are fired! Ladies and gentlemen, yeah, get out of here! Thanks for tuning back in to Pyro TV. I'm Chad Pancake. That was Miss O'Neill. And